Hey guys, welcome to the finale of Disgaea 4. Brian still hasn't seen Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. <laughs> I know no, it's only been a minute. Somehow, I don't think that was enough time to watch all 64 <laughs> motherfucking parts. <laughs> I guess I can watch it really fast. <laughs> or I can watch all the fights on YouTube and piece together the plot. <laughs> Please, just believe in my words once more. Just like you did back when you were a ragged soldier. I'm done with believing shit. Here's the box. Miss Artina? You're really... Yes. Please, open your heart to me. It's not Why going you? to work. We need a final boss. It's not gonna I, work. I Gotta open your heart to you. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking hate that part of the song. Yeah, I was gonna say, I like that song overall, but not, not that part. You know, if, if I got into an argument with someone over whether or not SA1 is better than SA2. All they would literally have to say to prove their point is, gotta open your heart, dude. <laughs> <laughs> and they would. <laughs> like, okay. All right. I, I, I get it. <laughs> I get, you don't need to say anything. I'm convinced. <laughs> oh, boy. You know, but my least favorite part of SA1 is um so the chaos fight you know how the music changes halfway through oh they reversed it yeah the 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 menacing music should have been first yeah mm -hmm. and then they did it again they saw like fucking generations so they had a chance to fix it and they didn't <laughs> brian if and this is a big if if we if we actually get that Sonic Adventure Remaster. I just couldn't forget There's a chance they could fix it. The demons. They could but fix the I'll wrongs see. that have been going on for 20 <laughs> years. <laughs> I, I mean, actually, 21. It came out in Japan a year earlier. Ugh. Right. You know, I'm not even... I'm not even convinced that I trust them to do it. <laughs> I don't know if I should get my hopes up. Well, oh yeah. I'm 50-50. I'm because, yeah, I, I don't really trust Sonic Team, but at the same time, they have been making a game for like four years now. That's what it looks like. Wait, they have? Forces was came out... No, no, three years. Forces came out like three years ago. Did you say they have been making a game, or they have I mean, I assume that they immediately started another game. I don't know, man. That's usually how they do it, like, right after... I mean, before, like, with Colors and Generations, they were making those at the same time. Right, but it could be, it could have been like, you know, if Forces doesn't do well, we're just gonna give up. <laughs> God, I hope. That I can move on with my life. So, uh, yeah. So I think we all know if that's the case. <laughs> What uh, they would uh, have been doing. <laughs> oh, okay, so what's actually happening in the game now? Uh, Nemo's come to his senses, and he's going to stop Fear the Great so that the world will be safe, and Artina will be safe, and everything will be all good and dandy. Falvatores ain't gonna have this shit. <laughs> <laughs> but why? <laughs> because, Brian, he is a human soul who has sinned. And he's going to turn this fucker into a printy if it's the last thing he does. <laughs> pretty he rule number to, one! <laughs> he is going to pay for his sins, damn it. <laughs> Mamatorus, no! Mamatorus, the game can be over! <laughs> But everyone else is just like, he can't, we can't just let this guy just walk away. This is the easy way out. We're gonna beat the shit out of him. <laughs> I 
have a t- I want to go home. <laughs> I want to go home. We we went to the moon. <laughs> Even Fenric's just like the fuck. What about all the lost because of it? Should we go back in time and save them too? He's a helpless fool. A fool who chose to perish because he couldn't bear his own weakness. And you Fenric with those hard truths. Almighty <laughs> God. What you're trying to do is the epitome of hypocrisy. You know, you could be right. It might just be for my own satisfaction. What he's done is not something that can be forgiven. The weight of his sins is immeasurable. But that's All right, Brian. So back to Full Metal Alchemist. Be able to take the easy way out by simply disappearing. He, uh, the one thing the that I know you have to watch it for it would take is that it has your new favorite character in it. He must be <laughs> Ah! Louise my new favorite Armstrong. Character. You're pretty harsh, Artina. What? <laughs> He's the worst beautiful. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. He is also Vegeta. Let's give him. <laughs> okay. Well, I do like me some Vegeta. <laughs> I, 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 I'll give you that. That is. That's a safe assumption. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> and what is he? Is he an anti-hero or is he like a, one of the good guys? No, no, he's a good guy. He's, no, no, I don't mean like character-wise. I mean voice actor. Oh! Is he... Is he voice... I'm talking about the dub. I'm talking about the dub. Right. Is he voiced by Chris Sabat? Yes. Answer. Yeah! Mm, I love me some Chris Sabat! <laughs> <laughs> I Although, want you to like, imagine Chris Sabat doing manly crying. <laughs> and being very in touch with his feelings. While also be being the most macho me. man in the world. I don't know if I can get through that without crying. <laughs> Myself. Oh no, no. You're gonna cry. <laughs> okay. You're gonna cry very early on. Alright, well, thanks. Thank you for the warning. Like, you're <laughs> still gonna... I'm not gonna spoil it, because... You don't know anything about the show, so you can actually experience it the way you were intended, blind. Right. <laughs> I now, want you to get like, through part one, Brian, by next by next session. Okay. All right, I might be able to handle. Let's say I can handle that. <laughs> oh my goodness. Sartina, why? Um, but. Otherwise, you will be dragged down. Like, it's so weird listening to All Might, knowing that it's the voice of Vegeta. It's just Chris Sabat. Yeah, like, it, it keeps going in and out, and like, hey, Jeets, how you how you doing, man? <laughs> what do you mean? Every once in a while, mean? you're just like, it's Piccolo. <laughs> what do you mean, plus Ultra? You don't say that, Vegeta. You just scream a lot. Talk about your pride. <laughs> Mention your pride. <laughs> no, we're serious. Armstrong does sound a little different. Okay, so he... I mean, it, it, it's still him, but... Right. <laughs> it did a little you something different. You know, it so much. Which I will never be able to pay off. It's best that I just disappear now. I mean... There's some voice actors who are who can change completely with like twenty thousand different voices. Right. Fucking. God, I forgot his name. The voice actor for Number One from Kids Next Door. Ben Disman. What else is? That's right. He voiced Number One. He voiced Number Two. What? Wow! Yeah, wow! He did, he did Number One and wow, Number Two. Wow! Hold the fucking phone. <laughs> <laughs> Back the fuck up! <laughs> no, he did not! <laughs> uh, he voices Spider-Man in one of the animated shows. <laughs> I, don't, I don't believe you! <laughs> you know what? Look it up! Number one VA and number two VA. <laughs> All right, special, you have to spell number one correctly. Oh, wait. Number. K-N-D. Yep. Okay. All right. You will. Benjamin Diskin, number one. Diskin. That's the duty of a okay. Now, number two. 
punishment, so you'll be able to pay off your sins faster. Oh, wait, no, there was- I know he- Benjamin Diskin! Yeah. <laughs> no! It's the same person. The, the illusion is shattered! <laughs> I mean, they sound completely different. I know. He, he also voices fucking Gonzo in Muppet Baby's Playdate. Brian, he voices so much shit. Master Xehanort! <laughs> oh yeah, he was Xehanort. Oh, so fun fact. It, uh, I, it was in an interview. Um, they had him voice his lines completely out of order. <laughs> so he was even more lost. <laughs> oh, he was Mega Man in Mega Man 11. That, oh. Now I hate him. Did Mega Man 11 come out? <laughs> yeah? I don't know. How I miss that? <laughs> I don't. I don't know. It's been out for a year. Cause like Mega Man's ten, nine and ten, I was privy to those, but I didn't know Mega Man Eleven came out yet. <laughs> this is the last resisting power that's trying to keep him here. As oh my God! Now he even kind of looks a little bit like Ganondorf. If Ganondorf had Wait, shorter what? white hair and wore a suit. <laughs> Oh, Nemo. Listen up, yeah. <laughs> it is the demons who must punish the humans for their sins. Your turn ends here. You know, like... Your system is no longer... No, like, I, I, I am disappointed that numbers one and two are played by the same person. <laughs> Why? But I still... I don't know! Because, like, it's just... It's just it's meta wrong. information that shatters the, the immersion. <laughs> All right, Brian, you ready for this final boss fight? I don't know. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, he has, he has he uh, has a, a malice version of Death X as his weapon. Seriously? Yeah. <laughs> Why isn't it shaped like a small girl connected to a soul? Because uh, monsters can transform into weapons. Really? Yeah. Is that Des been the case? Yeah, we did that with Dusko when we fought Dusax. <laughs> oh, well, I completely fucking missed that. Alright. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> is Valvatore the only one on the map? No, he's just the only one I'm using, because that's how you get the, the new cutscene that they added with the new voice. The, the new terrible voice. Oh. It's also not a good cutscene. <laughs> <laughs> well, that but that also might better. just be because of the voice. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, this attack. Is he? Is that the planet? <laughs> yes. <laughs> what? <laughs> I have questions. Every Disgaea <laughs> game has attacks like that. Also, zero damage. <laughs> <laughs> Miss. <laughs> Miss. <laughs> <laughs> it teleports behind you. <laughs> <laughs> that is that is glorious. That is actually. Oh, so this is like the worst attack to end this with. <laughs> <laughs> we did God it. Damn it! That was so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you ready? All right, listen to Alvator's voice. Do you see now, God? This is this is still Troy Baker. You will notice once we get to the new stuff. All right. So I'm just gonna keep quiet and wait. I'm gonna turn it up a little bit. Lord Val, Mr. Vampire. Oh, I'm waiting for it. It's coming. What? Where am I? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> ah. <laughs> Who are you? Oh god, he has more of an accent. It's so <laughs> bad. <laughs> you haven't even heard the fucking ugh. What does God want with me? Are you angry because we defeated fear the great? Hey, the Latox. It's so bad. Go back. <laughs> Please go back! 
why. This is why I won't ever record um, A Promise Revisited, which is the new chapter with this voice. It's so bad. Do not want. I <laughs> see. So you called me out here just to tell me that? Oh no, I don't like how he elongates his inflections. <laughs> Is that right? <laughs> so bad. It's so yeah. noticeable. Yeah. Hm. I am honored to be called upon by God. Tyrant Valgatori. Yeah. You shall not oppose me. Fear the great has but a fraction of my full power. Uh, hey God, may I ask you something? <laughs> Have you ever been slapped? <laughs> we will decide what God, I wish Troy Baker was voicing this. Yeah. Simply obey your orders. There's more I'd like to say, but I'm a little busy here. God. For today, I shall only strike you once. <sighs> wow. That's some fucking... You know what? If I actually do a promise revisited, I might just do the fucking Japanese voices. Yeah, no. That, that can work. <laughs> that way we can actually hear those, too. Yeah. I mean, yeah, that's kind of what they do. <laughs> he literally punches God. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that's definitely an attack I can do. Also, Artina's voice is somewhat different. She had to change, too. Yeah, you could tell a little bit. You'll hear in a sec. <laughs> No, I can yeah, tell. Yeah, yeah. I can, I can absolutely tell. It was that a little bit, <laughs> Austin. <laughs> way to hide the ball. This <laughs> <laughs> is so much squeakier. Anyway, who cares? All right, you ready for some abrupt shit? A, a what now? <laughs> some some abrupt shit. Alright. I mean, this entire trip has been pretty abrupt. Oh, look, it's Troy Baker again. Are you kidding me? You guys have too much for me. Oh my god! You must have Oh, that's not! So you only get that added stuff if you beat the final boss using only Valvatoris. <laughs> Why the I don't, I don't even know. Fuck it, whatever, it's back now. Everything's okay now. <laughs> it's 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 I'm safe. <laughs> not in pain anymore. <laughs> I guess it's between the demon. Like I I felt my life force training. I lost a couple <laughs> months off my life <laughs> from that. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't kidding. It's really bad. <laughs> No, I don't care. I'm kicking the shit. Wait, you're a ghost. Never mind. <laughs> no, he's gonna be a printing. Oh, so he's accepting that. Yeah. Some sense into your head once you become a printing in Hades. Printing rule number one. Rascal, <laughs> this is a job for you. Me. Yeah, you kicked your father's ass, so... No, he's dead. Oh, so what's he gonna do? Chop off his head or something? Yeah. I've never reaped a soul uh, wait, really? <laughs> yeah, he's, he's gonna reap his soul and send him back to Hades. Okay. okay. <laughs> yeah, just be confident. But don't cut off any weird parts. Um, oh, thank you, Fuga. Um, what now? <laughs> This music's a little too hopeful and triumphant for what's about to happen, I feel. Well, no, he's accepted his fate and everything he's done wrong. Now he's going to make good. <laughs> now cut off his head. <laughs> In the name of Dethanesel, I hereby sunder thy soul from this life. 
Judge Nemo, I'll see you in Hades. But before we go, pretty rule number one. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it, he's gone. <laughs> That's okay. Finally, we'll have time. The worlds were saved by the hands of the rebels from Hades, led by. A tiny but where's tiny Axel? <laughs> He's busy uh, getting his Dark Hero live show ready. <laughs> That's not a joke. I hope you're ready for the post game. <laughs> the names of these six heroes who saved the world were engraved into history to be taught for generations to come. On a side note, when Amizel was appointed to the position of Netherworld president, the name of President Axel was <laughs> Thank you! Good! <laughs> that's the way it should be! Darkness of history! Yeah! That's a, that's a pretty dark shit! <laughs> we did it, Brian. We saved the world. Why is it wearing an- Oh, sorry, he's- <laughs> <laughs> I got it! I got it! He finally gave the printies their sardine. From the beginning of the game. <laughs> Which one is, um, uh, fucking Nemo, though? <laughs> uh, we don't see him till the end. Also, the four, like, other characters there, they're the four characters you recruit at the beginning of the game. Right. <laughs> that I never used. <laughs> In fact, I actually, I actually got rid of them. I deleted them. You delete? You can do that? <laughs> yeah, you go to the Senate, and it literally just says, delete character. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, you can delete and create now. however many characters you want, except for main characters. <laughs> we didn't have very good benefits here anyway. <laughs> Our house insurance is shit. <laughs> My god, this song is anime. <laughs> yeah, just, just, just a little bit. <laughs> so is Death like the. Is Abizo like the president of the Hades now, or. <laughs> Wait, you cut out what? Is is Amazel the president of Hades now? <laughs> uh, no, Axel still is. I thought that was removed from. No, no, that's later. Records. He becomes okay. president later. Okay. <laughs> so wait, they still don't have a printy suit for her? <laughs> no, no, because she refuses to believe she's a printy. <laughs> she just beats she... up whoever fucking tries to. To put a suit on her. <laughs> okay. Oh, fuck it. Whatever. <laughs> Just as long as the other ones don't get any ideas. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's like Kringer a... X. Yeah. He's a robot. Right. <laughs> the Gundam Mecha Prince. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, and Desko is kidnapping princesses and taking uh, treasure because she's a final box. Is that what she's doing? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> is she still on that shit? Yes. <laughs> you know, let's just make another game just so Desko can be the final boss of it. I wish like, they'd I make a sequel for Disgaea 4. I think she's earned it. <laughs> <laughs> Is a measle like <laughs> that, that's the assassination. Forward. Yeah, okay. <laughs> also the pink cat is actually from um Disgaea 2. She's from um Axel's side story. Is she like relevant? Yeah, or? she helps him uh get a job. <laughs> Flan joins the uh the pretty rangers. <laughs> and that's Nemo. Okay. Also, the red moon is significant if you've played Disgaea 1. Are, are these games connected by yes. any way that isn't superficial? Okay. Yeah, like Flan is from Disgaea 1. Axel's from Disgaea 2. Alright. <laughs> uh, but uh, the red moon is... um. When the red moon shines, that's when Prinny's 
who have paid off their sins are allowed to be reborn as new humans. Oh, okay. Is um, is there like a certain frequency to when the red moons appear? Or uh, I don't or... fucking know. But that's just <laughs> when death uh, sends them back to the human world as purified souls. Okay. If you say, if, if, those are the, those them's the rules. <laughs> now I have a question. Does so is this the last game with um, Valvatores in it? Because uh, I kind of yeah. want to see him, like, uh, get back to badass level. <laughs> I mean, in Disgaea 5, there's DLC, and you recruit Valva Torres. And Is he like... in Disgaea 5, there's a new mechanic called the Overload mechanic, where mm -hmm. main characters uh, can use, like, special abilities for, like, one to three turns. And Valva Torres turns into Tyrant Valva Torres. Oh, that's cool. And his <laughs> ability while he's Tyrant Valvatores is any enemy he kills, um, they become his slaves. Oh, no! <laughs> because he's a vampire, so he takes control of them, and then they help you fight. Well, you know, that is, that is tyranty. <laughs> it's okay, still not that. as good, though, as the main character's skill in Disgaea 5. He gets three turns in one turn. Okay, yeah, that's, um... That's better. <laughs> and and he gets buffed uh, stats. Especially if you're, like, as overleveled as you as you were in this one. <laughs> uh, I wasn't the first time I played Disgaea 5. I played that one normally. Oh, okay. But, but still, for the post-game, that, I was completely very level. Uh, yeah. It's also a lot easier to grind into Sky 5. Right. Now, is the whole reason Valvatoris is weakened just because he stopped drinking human blood? Is that it? Yeah, he just got weaker because of that. That's kind of stupid. <laughs> Vampires need human blood. I, no, I, I, I don't think it's stupid that... That's why I think it's stupid that he's refusing to do it. Not Have that, you, you know, seen Valvator? <laughs> yeah, I, I get it. I understand. <laughs> hey, what is it? Hey, <laughs> shut what up. is it? <laughs> shut up. <laughs> I was waiting for you to say something. <laughs> back then, but I was too focused on my task, and it's fine. I actually still can't believe that you're so you can actually get different cutscenes here, depending on shit you do with the Senate and character relationships. There's, you can get an Amiza ending, a Fuka ending, Desco, Fenric. Artina's the default ending. But I can't help but ever see all the excitement in your eyes when you were talking about money. Mr. Vampire, you've gotten a little mean. Demon mean. <laughs> well, that's kind of the fearless attitude towards demons hasn't changed. That's kind of point. <laughs> really are, Artina. Now kiss. <laughs> no, no, they can't do that. Why? Because don't you get it? When when the when the two love interests kiss, that means the series is over. <laughs> but why? That's how these things work, right? <laughs> Audience interest wanes because it's happened. <laughs> they can still deal with their relationship better than Avatar did. <laughs> I kept worrying about Judge Nemo while you suffered the whole time because of that promise. As Mr. Werewolf said, I'm just a hypocrite. Well, Avatar is just an idiot, so. <laughs> but doing something is always better than not doing anything. Plus, by falling to Hades. I discovered sardines. <laughs> <laughs> Why are there sardines in Hades? Because <laughs> they need to feed the Prinny something. How did they get there? <laughs> you really are, Mr. Weirdo. I'm glad we got to meet again. Likewise. Now I finally get to keep the promise I made back then. Yes. I ended up making you wait. I'm gonna scare the shit out of you. Booga booga! <laughs> right. 
As I promised, I shall only quench my thirst after I take you down to the depths of despair. <laughs> now, how shall I go about this? This will be most interesting. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's no need to do that to me. What do you mean by that? I've already seen the depths of despair. When you were dragged inside of Fear the Great, I thought I had lost you. Okay, now they kiss. Okay. <laughs> with fear, just oh my god. <laughs> All I could do was stand there, trying not to scream out loud. Artina. You have kept your promise. Now, can he even do that? You're dead? <laughs> I mean, even human she, she's... Uh, I, shush. I think <laughs> angels have, like, human blood in them. That's... Like, same with Fenric. Like, okay. <laughs> it's over. We did it. Wait, so, wait. Does does he do it or not? <laughs> no. <laughs> what? Why? <laughs> I do Okay, okay, yeah, fuck Because it. the Fenrix ending's canon, that's why. <laughs> and what happens in Fenrix? I don't know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'd have to play through this whole game again. You think I'm gonna do that? No. Wait, you have to play through the whole game? You can't just change the stuff and then redo the final boss? I mean, I guess you could, but... <laughs> you still have to play through the whole game to get the cutscene. I mean, you could save beforehand, but still. See, so yeah, look at all this new shit. Look at all that shit. <laughs> we get to do all that. Oh, goody. <laughs> and now without the story to keep me gripped. <laughs> oh, no, no, there's still story. Oh, really? <laughs> it's just a uh, new story. All right. I think the next thing I'll record is the Fuka and Desco show. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, but, tune yeah, in next time. That was what? well. No, we're not going to do that immediately. We're gonna we're going to Paper Mario, right? Yeah, I mean, I was gonna say whatever the fuck is next. I don't know. Ariel keeps track I'm, of that shit. I'm pretty sure it's Paper <laughs> Mario, which means you're up. Oh, you're, you finally have to have work. Yeah, By the way, have you ever looked at like? Our, our lists of what we've recorded. Of what we've gotten done? Yes. I don't want to because I feel like you're going to point out that it's a lot of You have like half as up. much as both me and Ariel. Yeah, no, that's what I thought. <laughs> 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 that's what I thought you were going to say. Mm-hmm. And I don't want to talk about this anymore. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye!